so today I'm gonna be showing you the results of uh, bio advanced uh, lawn weed and uh, crabgrass killer and uh, also my lawnmower is uh, green works 10 amp uh, 16 inch corded uh, I've been using this since I got this for less than $150 and uh, and I've uh, used it a lot and hasn't disappointed it's uh, it's pretty good for 10 amp uh, gets the job done and the results uh, for the weed killer is this these were dandelions these were all yellow now they're all dry I'm gonna be cutting them and then so the grass has stayed perfect these are all dead dandelions my uh, yard was full full filled with dandelions these are all dead and then I have a patch here that just there's nothing but dead dandelions here as you could see oh this one has just popped up oh well yeah as you could see these are all dead this is a mixed grass there is I believe uh, kakuyu and uh, tall fescue here so I have some bare spots here all right you can see I'll be using the rebel uh, the Pennington uh, tall fescue seeds to uh, cover up this area all right <laughs> going to be mowing right now. can uh, put these runners uh, in the soil and uh, they'll grow wherever that's bare uh, they'll grow if the soil is good enough if you need to add soil add some soil mix with compost until uh, roots form and grab onto the soil well yeah Here's a little tip So uh, I uh, put some of the uh, tall fescue seed down to uh, mix with the rest and I uh, covered it lightly uh, with some topsoil. So this bare area, we're going to patch it up and that little area there and uh, yeah, well that should do it. Let's see how it goes. I'm pretty confident. And uh, yeah, if you guys have any questions uh, or suggestions, let me know. Okay, talk to you guys later.